Then we're going to go center of these bleachers and everyone over here. You are my wild, crazy wolf wolf. Can I get a wolf wolf? Hi. Welcome to TTV. It is Saturday, August 20th, 2022. I'm Tim, and in today's news, here's some uplifting news for you. Rocky the dog is now home after taking off into an airplane and he had a parachute on and was like, woof, woof, woof. And in local news, <music> Three Dog Night is coming to Del Lago Resort and Casino on Saturday, October 15th at 8 o'clock p.m. And the tickets are on sale now, and on this day's in history, <music> on August 20th, 1975, 47 years ago, Viking 1 is launched to Mars. On August 21st, 1959, 63 years ago, Hawaii becomes the 50th state. On August 22nd, 1864, 158 years ago, the International Red Cross is founded. On August 23rd, 1784, 238 years ago, the state of Franklin declares independence, which is eventually... Tennessee, on August 24th, 79, after discovery, 1,943 years ago, Mount Vesuvius erupts. And visit history.com for more. This day's in history. And in famous birthdays. See this link? Click this link. And in non-famous birthdays, SSA Leagues and Mason Corey Grossbeck on August 20th. Tara Tatu and my mom, Nancy Bennett on August 21st. Chloe Tiso on August 22nd. Chelsea Danielle and Tim Noble on August 24th. Joshua Nowlin and Annie Caputo on August 25th. Nikki Gatano, Michael Sill, Seth Braddock, and Miss Sarah Wright on August 26th, and Eric Joseph Dobish on August 27th. And in air show news, <laughs> United States Air Force Thunderbirds, name Justin Elliott, rank Lieutenant Colonel, call sign Boss, plane number one, his schools were, were Yale University and the United States Air Force Weapons School. And he's from Houston, Texas. Interesting fact. He has 255 hours of combat pilot experience in 30 aircraft. The United States Air Force Thunderbirds next air show, August 19th to August 21st. McMinnville, Oregon, at the Oregon International Air Show. United States Navy Blue Angels. Uh, United States Navy Blue Angels 
we're practicing circles and arrivals for this weekend when the Chicago Cubs were playing a baseball game at Wrigley Field, which, much to the fans' surprise, but they do this every year. And United States Navy Blue Angels next air show is August 20th and August 21st. Chicago, Illinois. Chicago Air and Water Show. And in weather. The National Weather Service in Binghamton has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for extreme northwestern Broome County, Shimon County, western Cortland County, southeastern Schuyler County, Tioga County, Tompkins County, Bradford County, until 7 o'clock p.m. What makes summers in central New York so great? It's not too humid for too long. It's not too hot for too long. There's not too many bad storms. Uh, it's a nice lake breeze. And there's no winter weather white stuff. And the average maximum temperature, 79.7 degrees. Average precipitation, 10.66 inches. And the average dew point is 59.8. Compared to Dallas-Fort Worth, Texas, who averaged 94.3 with temperature, compared to average days with 90 degrees in Miami, Florida, which is all of them. <laughs> yeah, I would want to live down in Florida. Especially when <laughs> you got to worry about all the hurricanes and the tropical storms and stuff. And Saturday, August 21st, it's going to be partly cloudy with a high of 93 and a low of 68. Sunday, August 21st, it's mostly cloudy with a high of 84 and a low of 68. Monday, August 22nd, then with Tuesday, August 23rd, thunderstorms with a high of 77 and a low of 64. Wednesday, August 24th, which is the first day of the New York State Fair, and that's going to be morning showers. So you might have to duck into a building when they open at 10 a.m. Or if you're lucky, they might open it up even sooner than that. You just can't walk around until 10. With a high of 81 and a low of 61. Thursday, August 25th. Mostly sunny. With a high of 84 and a low of 63. Friday, August 26th. Partly cloudy, with a high of 82 and a low of 62. On Saturday, August 27th, partly cloudy, with a high of 82 and a low of 64. And that's your weather. And in entertainment news, is uh, well, well, Top Gun Maverick is still flying past other movies in the box office record books as it has now $679 million domestically to Avenger of Infinity Wars $678 million and Top Gun Maverick's continued success proves that movie theaters aren't dead and unfortunately HBO Max has removed 200 episodes of Sesame Street from the streaming platform as it prepares to merge with Discovery Plus and this is the summer of 2023 and in events news Saturday August 20th Jessica Novak Bellevue Country Club in Syracuse at 7 o'clock p.m. Sunday August 21st Sunday morning meditation at the Foundation of Light in Ithaca at 10 o'clock a.m. Monday, August 22nd, story play at the Community Library of DeWitt and Janesville at 10.30 a.m. Tuesday, August 23rd, it's messy kid art at the Dunham Public Library at 11 o'clock a.m. 
on Wednesday, August 24th, Mary Chapin Carpenter at the Smith Opera House in Geneva at 8 o'clock p.m. Thursday, August 25th, Dungeons and Dragons Part B at the Onondaga Free Library at 6 o'clock p.m. Also on Thursday, August 25th, you know, you knew better. We should have stayed just friends. Kaylee Hammett. The trouble with girls is they're a mystery. Scotty McCreary. And now for the main act. To the plumber that came today, you're just another dip. If you don't feel important, Sonny, all I got to say is to the world. You may be just another girl, but to me, baby, you are the world. Fred Paisley. It's the Fred Paisley World Tour 2022 at the Lakeview Amp at 7.30 p.m. Yeah, unfortunately, with some of these events, there's a cost of $25.25. That's fifty-five dollars. And on Friday, August twenty-sixth, Harmonic Dirt at the Crazy Daisies Flower Farm in Syracuse at six o'clock p.m. And Saturday, August twenty-seventh, Green Lakes Endurance Runs at Green Lake State Park at six o'clock a.m. You have to get up early, wait early for that one, folks. And Wednesday, August 24th to Monday, September 5th, the 2022 Great New York State Fair. The gates open at 9 a.m. with buildings opening at 10 a.m. And now it is time for Tim's Joke of the Day. You heard the rumor going around about butter? <laughs> Does anybody got anything yet? Oh, man. Never mind. I shouldn't spread it. <laughs> oh, jeez. And you can email us at TibbsTV1 at Yahoo.com. Like us on Facebook, Tim's Television TTV, and Tim Bennett Productions. Follow us on Twitter at Tim's TV One, and subscribe to Tim's Television TTV on YouTube. So until next time, I'm Tim. Have a great week, and we have an important announcement, people. Who view this podcast? Yes, I am still on the hunt for mentors. So, just like, so to avoid what hap- what happened back in February again, I am going to be taking. A two-week hiatus from doing this podcast. But you can look forward to seeing me at my home away from home three times this year. I wish it was more, but it is what it is. At the great New York State Fair. And you can look for those over on our new stranger, Tim's Show and Tell account. Because I I had it on there before I put it on Tim's Television TTV. I've had that one account for five years now. I've had this account, Tim's Television TTV, for four. So, I hope you guys all enjoy the fair, 
and my fair coverage, which is which is gonna be coming straight at you. <laughs> And that's the end of the show. And we're going to go center of these bleachers and everyone over here. You are my wild, crazy wolf wolves. Can I get a wolf wolf?